Hey guys, this is a bit of a change for my celebrity story video. I was going to post meeting Gillian Anderson next, but recently Helen McCrory passed away and it is really heartbreaking. She was a really lovely person and I thought I'd make this video as like a little tribute. I met her two times and both at times were really lovely interaction. This is my story of meeting Helen McCrory twice. So the first time I met Helen it was a very small venue in the like back streets of London. I was there to meet her and Alan Rickman. So this this was going back quite a while. My sister came with me and my mum. My mum didn't have anything she needed signed or wanted signed from Helen at that time. This was very early when I started meeting celebrities and stuff so I asked her a favour. I was like, would you mind, <laughs> you know, getting my book signed because I also had something else I wanted to and my mum was fine with that. Um, so anyway, we were front row of this tiny little um, cinema thing and there was like I think about four of us in this whole little row um, Helen's husband Damien came first and he was so lovely he took selfies with us and then he like kind of coaxed Helen over to us because we'd come in costume I was Bellatrix and my sister was in my Draco <laughs> I think because she didn't have anything at that time that kind of worked like I think she only had Ron and Ginny which is like no so I let her use my Draco wig and stuff um, but she was lovely we had a selfie together like my sister took the photo because I think I had too much in my hands or was shaky or something but we're all in this picture together it's really nice look at her with her sunglasses and everything she's just looking so cool and she was just so polite and lovely, you know, she was just one of those really polite people. But my mum got my Order of the Phoenix signed, which she's right here. I got my, my Narcissa Malfoy wand signed by her on that day and honestly I'm going to treasure this now because you know, I'll never be able to get that again. My, uh, part of me, you know, I wanted to show her my Rosanna Cavieri costume and my Lucius, hoping that she'd be booked for a convention or something someday, because she seemed the type to be that friendly that she might do one one day, but this was at a theatre awards, which was my second interaction with her. I was actually there at the time when I was in university, and I didn't know who was going to be there, you know, it was just like a big lineup of celebrities so we had like a ton of stuff. Um, usually when I attend things I usually have like a little folder about this thick of just prep prints in case, because sometimes when you would do these events other guests would turn up from other things and it had happened to me so many times that I thought I'm going to get a few prints of my favourite actors and just keep hold of them in here just in case and so I actually had a print for Helen on that night and it was this Rosanna Calvieri image as there was just something about her character in Doctor Who I just I adored it she was just awesome and that was why she's my only Doctor Who cosplay but she was there, she was like, even though it was so rammed, I think I've got a clip from my um, my documentary actually that I made for uni and I'll try and find the clip and put it in here, but she was so lovely, even though it was rammed with people, she was still trying to answer people's questions. Can you sign here please, Yes, absolutely, sir. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Sorry? Hello, I didn't know I was doing a book sign. Hello? Hello? Am I? Oh no, I think, uh, oh no, 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 that's not book signing. That's a, um, no, it's an evening of poetry. And so I think. Hello? 
<laughs> Bring them up. Oh, that is. Hey, hey you're right. Robert. Thank you. This is somebody's pen. It was the fact she took that time again to just be so polite and kind with people. She she was never one of those uh, celebrities I met that came, gave like kind of a angry vibe, if that makes sense, or rude. She was always very polite. She tried to sign for everyone. I just I never had a bad experience meeting Helen, and kind of heartbroken. I'll never get another because she was a really talented actor and a lovely woman. Like. But yeah, rest in peace Helen, you were a lovely person and I'm very, very thankful and grateful that I got to meet you twice.